supposed to be the best steakhouse in Naha, Okinawa. But because my sister doesn't eat meat and my mom hates half cooked meat, so we're skipping. So we're currently riding on the bus going to a unknown mysterious place. So since we're staying at a resort, there is honestly no way of getting out. So we are restricted to eat, to dine at the hotel slash resort restaurants. But they look yummy anyways. Why would you want to go outside? And ooh, outdoor patios. I know these are probably not the most authentic Okinawa food, but just look at the view. Oh, right by the beach. So my sister is 20 years old. She still considers herself. What the hell just did I and are you filming me? Because this is a kid's corner. So supposedly my mom booked a nice fancy hotel room. But well, my Let's just check it out, cause don't know. All right. Whoa. Okay. Definitely bigger than the one yesterday. All right. My sister already just lying on the couch, lying on the bed. All right. Let's just check out the views because I think this is what it's gonna get as the wall effect. Whoa. Ooh. Okay, this is definitely, definitely a million dollar views. Well, okay. Can I just like stay here forever? So I suppose you can say Okinawa to Japan is like Hawaii to America because they're both islands off its mainland and they're both so beachy, oceany, and like summer vacation destinations. And honestly, if I could move here tomorrow, I will. Going on the... Ooh, the water is actually really warm. I didn't expect it. I thought it would be a lot colder, but I guess being the summer and in the middle of August and in the middle of August with so many tourists being, you know, sort of dirty and, you know, a lot of trash on the beach. But honestly, there isn't. Well, if you don't want to leave me, take a look. And there are also tons of water activities that you can do over here. It's just uh, my family is not the type. So we decided to get one of these taro snacks, taro dessert, taro tart kind of thing because it is honestly sold everywhere we go in Okinawa. And I'm sure if you visit, you'll know what I'm talking about because it's literally everywhere. All right, let's just open it up. Okay. <sighs> All right. Need a little bit of the force, but this is the packaging. It's fancy looking. Okay. How do we open it? Ah. Ta -da! So we got the medium size, and there are six of them in here. All right. That's. Just eat it. Why are these like packaging so hard to open? 
Is that so fancy? Like, looks like a boat thingy, but. Hmm. It's very cake like. I mean, it is a. Like, it is a, a cake batter over here. Like, it's very soft, and you can really taste, like, the taro being like. It's like potatoes but sweet potatoes but like purple sweet potatoes you know what I mean mm -hmm. and because it was so yummy and unlike any of the really sweet Japanese sweets we had we got a lot a lot a lot but to justify our expenses these are all for family friends friends at work and family. This is matcha soft serve. If you leave out a muffin for like a week and put it, dip it into brown sugar, this is how it would taste like. 